My News 26 and CCTV. It's high school basketball. Coming to you tonight from Cadillac High School. And welcome back to Cadillac. Cadillac Varsity Girls Basketball here on CCTV and 26 Sports. An exciting contest tonight. Big North Conference opener for both teams. Cadillac scoring a victory. Hanging on in the fourth quarter. Final score of 46 to 39. So Traverse City Central down 10 at halftime. Definitely made a game of it, Eric. What do they do to compete here in the second half? Well, they established a low post presence. They really handled Cadillac's ball pressure better. And they made their layups, which Cadillac failed to do on a lot of occasions, which kept this game a lot closer than it probably should have been. Agreed, yeah, I definitely agreed. And, uh, of course, Cadillac, uh, Kylie Christensen, their leading scorer, uh, got early foul trouble, sat out a lot of the first half, which might have kept the score a little closer than it could have been. Comes in the second half, tried to assert herself. She finishes the game with what was the total? 22 points. 22 points to finish the game. Definitely a little bit above her season average. Uh, Cadillac doing something that Coach Johns was talking about pregame, finishing in the fourth quarter. In their opening conference loss at Gaylor, they were up nine in the third quarter, Coach mentioned, because, well, she didn't want to make excuses at all about the volleyball turnaround, but they ran out of gas in the fourth quarter, weren't able to maintain that lead. Today, different story, up ten at half, finished the game, winning by seven. Uh, Traverse City pushed him, made it tight in the fourth quarter, but Cadillac pushed through. How did they do that? Well, a lot of it is Kylie Christian stepped up. She was the senior leader. She scored eight points in the fourth quarter, including two huge free throws towards the end there to really kind of seal it for Cadillac. She got a lot of rebounds, made a steal, hit a couple clutch threes in this game, and really just had a good all-around game. And then their ball pressure. I, yeah. I mean, their, their defense, Cadillac's defense with those Emmington girls and, and, and Kelly Paulus, they were all over the floor. And, and they have four girls that can handle the rock really, really well. The really, really strong ball handlers were able to get Kylie the ball in positions where she was comfortable, where she could score, and Kylie scored. And you mentioned there's a lot of positions that she's comfortable scoring. She can score inside, she can step back and shoot the three like you mentioned. Two Good for point. two tonight. So rounding out the scoring for Cadillac, Eric? Uh, Hannah Emmington had, f or I'm sorry, Hope Emmington had five points. Hannah had four. Morgan Canals had four, Kaylee Paulus had seven, and Alexis Little had four points for Cadillac. And for Traverse City, Saint, uh, Traverse City Central Trojans, definitely made a, a ball game of it. You had Ashley Bone coming alive in the in the second half, asserting herself. Mary Drake hitting a bunch of shots. Can you walk us through their scoring? Uh, Margot Wolfer added five, Sage Hill two, Stevie Herbers had six. Very smooth. 19 from Mary Drake, very smooth. I was really impressed with her shooting stroke. And as you had mentioned, Ashley Bowen with seven points, really tough there in the third quarter, had a lot of good hard or good easy buckets because of her hard work getting position, really worked hard for Traverse City tonight. Absolutely. So what happens as you're trying to get your feet wet, as you're trying to get your, your basketball legs underneath you, transitioning from different seasons. Cadillac had a lot of girls play, play volleyball, as we mentioned. The one thing you can hang your hat on before your offense starts clicking on all cylinders is a defense. And so we want to hats off to their defensive pressure tonight, as we mentioned countless times, that it was just on point and, and really the reason that, and their catalyst to winning this game tonight. So They forced a lot of turnovers. That was, that was tough for Traverse City, especially in the first half, to get anything going offensively because of that ball pressure. So they even their record to 1-1 one one in the conference, and uh, Traverse City Central... That was their first conference game, so they're 0-1, so the defending champs not out of it by any means early in the season. So a good contest and a good measuring stick for both teams. And so we want to thank everybody tonight for tuning in. I want to remind you that this is going to air tonight at 10 o'clock on My News 26. We want to make note and mention our sponsors one more time. We've got Pizza Plus, Cadillac Tire, High Point GMC. We can't thank you enough for all the things you do for us. We want to thank our crew tonight. We want to thank Levi Welts, Jacob Fulis, and Rain Johnson Hill running the cameras under some tough circumstances and some technical difficulties. They did a fine job. Kaylee Buck doing the graphics. And of course, our director, Dakota Pike. For Eric Richards, I'm Kevin Gregory. Thank you and have a good night.